Eric Kaluzik with all Corners Home Inspections. This is the crawl space evaluation for this single family home here in Salem, Oregon. As with all the videos in this report, we would request that you uh, view this video as supplemental to the written version of the report to which this video has been attached. At the time of inspection, there were a number of reportable challenges. Single family homes uh, raise foundation crawl space. First is that we have no insulation in between the floor joists. You will lose a fairly substantial percentage of the heating, depending on home heating and cooling. Uh, cost of this area underneath the home. I recommend getting insulation down here as soon as possible. Uh, we will also note that there's no insulation around the distribution plumbing in the crawl space. This is a hot side. This red side is a hot side and you're going to lose a lot of the heat to the area underneath the home. The ductwork is disconnected at the area more or less under the kitchen uh, space. Uh, you're basically just heating the area underneath the home at this point. A lot of work has been performed down here. Uh, the, there's a lot of support structure that's been added. However, there's no uh, union points. There's no uh, fasteners holding the, uh, the posts, even though they're pressure treated. Uh, there's, no, there's no isolation between the concrete pad. This is an example here between the concrete pad and the, concrete and the uh, pressure treated post. There's also no connection point between the post and the, um, and the girder above. Uh, nails, brackets, etc. would be recommended at those locations as in a seismic activity. If you have seismic activity, these posts can shift. Uh, and then uh, lose support for the girders above. Recommend licensed contractors be called upon to make evaluations and necessary changes, alterations to the structure. There are a couple of all on some inspections.